this is uh, Mr. Bo from MrBoEnglish.com. We are near the end of uh, the quadratics, uh, uh, quadratics unit in Khan Academy, and I've been doing this, these videos for like a month, it seems. So I'm happy we're getting to the end. It's a big, it's a big unit. Um, you can see 2,900 points. <laughs> and uh, we're going to be in, in one of the final two sections, final two lessons, and this one is on features and forms of quadratic functions. It's really kind of a review unit, and it's going to take all the stuff that we, we did and, and put it together, and we have to decide which one to use when. Uh, and you can see over here there are five, uh, five uh, practices, so we'll be going through in five videos. Shock. Okay, so let's uh, let's review a little bit. We we we've, we've uh, done three forms, okay, and uh, the first form that uh, the first form that we did was the factored form, and that looks like f of x is equal to a something times something, and they may be two x or three x. I don't know, I guess I'll say bx minus x1 and cx minus x2. These b's and c's are not related to anything else. Um, but uh, the important thing is that uh, it allows us to easily find the, uh, the zeros, the x-intercepts, and then we can split the middle and we can find the axis of symmetry and then we can find the vertex on there. And uh, that's the first thing we did. And then the second thing we did in, uh, in con here was uh, the vertex form, which is equal to a times x minus x1 squared plus y1. Um, and uh, x1, y1 is the vertex, so it's easy to find the vertex from here. And the last, uh, well really we studied standard form way long ago, um, but we didn't use it. Right, we didn't use it uh, until the end here. ax squared plus bx plus c when we got into uh, quadratic formula and such. So. Um, and C tells us y-intercept, because when uh, the y-intercept is when x is 0, and so these two terms go away and we're left with C. So C tells us the y-intercept, factored form tells us zeros or x-intercepts, and then the vertex form tells us all about the vertex. So uh, our first question, which form most quickly reveals the y-intercept? And the y-intercept looks like the standard. So we need to find the one that looks like standard form. And here it is. And what is the y-intercept? It is 24. And how do we know that? Because when x is 0, we have the y-intercept 0 minus 0 plus 24. Okay, uh, function g is given in three equivalent forms. Which form most quickly reveals the zeros or roots of the function? And that's going to be our factored form. Our factored form shows zeros, so we're looking for something that looks like that. Here it is. x plus something, x minus something. Okay, there it is. And write one of the zeros. Let me see. x minus 1 is 0. x minus 1 is 0, so x is equal to 1. Okay. Uh, the function f is given in three equivalent forms. Equivalent means uh, similar, same, equal, okay. Uh, which form most quickly reveals the, the vertex? So which one shows us the vertex? Vertex form, it looks like a x minus x1 squared plus y1, so which one looks like that? It's our one over here. And what's the vertex? x minus x1, so it's x minus negative 3 plus 25 halves. There we go. 
and one more. Which form most quickly reveals the zeros or roots? Which one are we looking for? Zeros. We want the factored form. X minus something times X minus something. Oh, here we go. 2 times X plus 6 times X plus 2. There we go. And write one of the zeros. So X plus 2 is equal to 0. X is equal to negative 2. If you're not clear about this, you need to go back and, and go back, go back, 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 back to the one that you're not clear on. If you don't, uh, if you're missing the ones about factored form, go back and do factored form. If you're missing the questions about vertex form, go back and do vertex form. If you're missing standard form, go back and do standard form for a while. Okay, go back, clean it up, do it again, come back and review, and uh, should be should be uh, should have gotten these uh, uh, basically all correct and in record time. So, uh, but if you still have questions, you can't work it out. Uh, don't be afraid to contact us at mrboenglish.com. Mr. Bo English, rap saw a knuckly and dunk that boss on. Couldn't buy tang internet nice at thy EP crap. Who some tie twitty dog root jang blue by website t www.mrboenglish.com.